Hello, hello, hello. Hello, everybody. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. We talked the whole night through. Good morning. Good morning to you. Welcome to the Coffee Break with Tara by Laura Gonzalez. Hello Soto. Hello Soto is here already. And is it true forever? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Today is Wednesday and we have oracles. Coincidentally, I'm wearing pink. <laughs> Which movie is that one? That they wear pink on Wednesday? Anyway, um, we have the Anatomy of a Witch by the one and only Laura Tempesacra. We have the Celebration of Love by Eva Shakmar Sullivan. And we have the Gospel of Aridia by Stacey DeMarco. Mean Girls. Oh, my God. No. I'm trying not to be one of them. Uh, <laughs> emphasis on trying. I don't know if I can accomplish it. But I will try not to be a mean girl. I was on the other end most of my childhood. So believe me, I try not to be. Uh, no mean girls here. Anyway, let's see what the oracles have for us today. By the way, a very, very happy Mother's Day to um, those who celebrate today. I know here in the United States is Sunday, but in a lot of countries, such as Mexico, um, Mother's Day is May 10. So happy Mother's Day. Oh, I know, I know that the Mean Girls is the movie. I know, I know, I know, I know. I asked what's the movie because I couldn't remember the name of the movie. Uh, but no, let's not be mean girls. <laughs> I vaguely remember the movie. But anyway, happy Mother's Day to people who have babies and people who have fur babies and people who have creation as their babies. Creativity, creation arts or things or businesses or whatever and um happy mother's day all right let's see what's our first oracle come on didn't want to come out all right the first oracle is banish Ooh. <laughs> why did this just reminded me of Elohim Leafar. Well, because he was doing something like this on his Instagram not too long ago. So Banish is the name of the card. And let's see what the meaning of it is. Oh my goodness. Okay, it says Hi Janet and hi Vintage Lucket and Marvelously Marissa. Welcome, welcome, welcome. So banish. Dun, 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 dun. Let go of what holds you back. Reduce clutter. All of the elements can be useful in banishing and might be used in combination. Fire consumes, earth absorbs, water dissolves, and air dispenses. For example, Words can be written on paper, earth, instead of lace, and reduced to ash, fire, then released to the wind, air, and washed away by rain or river, water. So I repeat, let go of what holds you back, reduce clutter. All of the elements can be useful in banishing and might be used in combination. Fire consumes, earth absorbs, water dissolves, and air dispenses. For example, words can be written on paper, earth, instead of lace and reduced to ash, fire, 
then release in the wind, air, and wash the way by the rain or river, and that will be water. Hi, Adrienne and Beth Baker. Welcome to the coffee break. Um, so the first card is saying banish. And if you are in the Chicagoland area, Sunday, pardon me, Saturday, Saturday the 13th, I will be at the Bougie Bazaar Mayflowers. Bougie Bazaar Mayflowers, along with a huge array of vendors, crafters, witchy crafters, um, people selling their arts and wares and all kinds of stuff. I will be offering, obviously, tarot readings, my art prints, and um, some of those um, decorative candles that have my art on them. And that event is from 12 to 6 on Saturday at the Revolutionary Brewery and Tap Room. So find the event. You can find it on my Calendly or you can find it on my uh, Facebook page, Bougie Bazaar Mayflowers. And uh, that's curated by Lotus Elise. And it's happening this Saturday from 12 to 6. So come and join us. It's going to be fun. She always puts on fun events. And um, yeah, so come and join us for that. And then on Sunday, I have a class. I'll tell you about the class in a minute. Oh, look at this. Empathy. Peace Rainbow. Empathy. It reminds me of the world card on tarot. Let's see what the message is for empathy. Okay, okay, the C D E Empathy. Where are you? Right here. Oh, it's a short one. All right, cool. And it says you are holding on to a prejudice about someone something or possibly yourself ask that you break through to see the universal perspective of this and to celebrate the oneness of all we're basically <laughs> that's why i was smiling because it's basically the same message from earlier but repeated and like with different words a second time so you are holding on to a prejudice about someone, something, or possibly yourself. Ask that you bear, ask that you break through to see the universal perspective of this and to celebrate the oneness of it all. You are holding on to a prejudice about someone, something, or possibly yourself. Ask that you break through to see the universal perspective of this and to celebrate the oneness of all. That is the message on that one. That was the celebration of love. And last but not least, we have the um, the Gospel of Aradia. So I was telling you I'm doing a class over the weekend on Sunday night. Uh, you can still buy your tickets for that class. We're going to be doing creativity spells. So we're going to talk about creativity we're going to talk about creation. We're going to talk about magic. And we're going to talk about magic and spells done with art and creativity. And really, I'm looking, really, really looking for, forward for that class. Uh, because it's going to be a good one. Not because I'm teaching, but because I've been preparing so much for that class. So I really hope that you can join us. And that is part of the spell classes that I've been doing all year. By the way, they are available on demand. And you can come and purchase them a la carte, if you will. So we have done candle spells, love spells, cleansing spells, prosperity spells. So January, February, March, April. And then for May, we're doing creativity spells. And then in uh, June we're doing sun spells and then in July we're doing moon spells 
and then we're going to do at one point ancestor spells and um, I can't recall but anyway classes are only $25 and you can go to my link tree or you can go to the events here on Facebook and find the link uh, for Eventbrite to buy your tickets and the ones that are already passed just hit me up if you want to buy them and then I can send you the link all right let's see what this card is saying sisterhood we have the card of sisterhood just like every Wednesday this oracles are calling me out on everything if you know you know all right sisterhood and I read how is it is to ignore the deep bonds of women there is no need to compete against your sisters gossip about other women is betrayal your sister or a woman who is like a sister to you needs your attention at this time the softness the grace the heart woven in mine my sister is like me I will never leave her behind her curves are a sigil for her long and free so deeply we weave my sisters like me sisters kindred spirits um camaraderie I guess hello Adrian and Lake Bar <coughs> hello Soto <coughs> excuse me sending all kinds of hearts this is cute so first we were told to banish then to let go of judgment and now we're told to come together you know <clears throat> i'll read again how easily is to ignore the deep bonds of women there is no need to compete against your sisters gossip about other women is betrayal your sister or a woman who is like a sister to you needs your attention at this time the softness the grace the heart woven in mine my sister is like me i will never leave her behind our curves are a sigil or her long and free so deeply we weave my sisters like me that is super cute and <clears throat> never forget the family what the hell <clears throat> family is not only given and blood but family is what you choose may you be so lucky to choose your family it's a very cute thing when you are able to choose your family so earlier when i pulled the car from the laura tempesakroff um anatomy of a witch a second car came through and you know I read the cards when they stick to my fingers and we have a bonus card but before I give you the bonus card I have to give you a commercial Thursday mystic chat with Chris Allen and Frater Aaron we're going to be talking about the paths different paths on witchcraft so tune in at mystic chat on Facebook or on YouTube so thursday mystic chat saturday buji bazaar at the revolutionary brewery from 12 to 6. sunday creativity spells class online with yours truly if you cannot find me it's because you really aren't looking hard enough so uh lake bar says i love it i love it too there that was very cute the one that, with the sisters so we have amulet if I tell you how I couldn't love this more because it reminds me of home and uh, traditions in Mexico for those who don't know I am Mexican from Mexico did you know did you know I am Mexican from Mexico I am not Mexican American. A lot of people think I'm Mexican American. I'm not. I'm Mexican from Mexico. I was born and raised in Mexico City 25 years ago. Came to the States. Okay, amulet. 
symbols have power, but what that power is depends on our relationships with the symbol and how we might utilize it. Have you noticed any symbols showing up repeatedly for you? What amulets do you cherish and why do they have power in your personal practice? Ha, El Osoto says, I'm Mexican by way of California. <laughs> cool. We are kindred spirits. All right. Uh, symbols have power. But what that power is depends on our relationship with the symbol and how we might utilize it. Have you noticed any symbols showing up repeatedly for you? What amulets do you cherish and why do they have power for you in your personal practice? So this is more a reflection, a little bit more than a message. It is kind of like a reflection on amulets and symbols and all that kind of stuff. So folks, I'm not going to bore you again with more announcements. You know where I'm going to be, when I'm going to be. You also know <clears throat> I do private readings. You can hire me for a private session in person or online. And if you are so lucky to be in the most beautiful city on the planet, which is Chicago, come see us at the Revolutionary Brewery on Saturday at the Buji Bazaar um, Mayflowers. All right, folks, have a wonderful rest of your weekend. I hope I can see you Friday. I think I should be able to see you Friday. Uh, but if I don't see you Friday, then I will see you Monday. But until I see you again, never forget that you are loved. You are loved. Bye-bye.